Hey, what's up? It's your favorite piece of meat, Random Stencil here. I got some exciting news to tell you. I got some really exciting news to tell you about. Uh, there's been a rumor that Rocksteady is making a Superman game. Uh, it's actually been, for quite some time, we've had rumors of going inside and out. But we have a leak from 4chan. Now, this may or may not be true. Take with a grain of salt, you get the idea. This person has a whole bunch of lists of what's in this game, and that it's going to be shown in E3 this year, this summer, whatever it's going to be shown. Basically, it's made by Rocksteady. It's using a, an Unreal Engine 4. Big open world metropolis, about three times the size of Arkham Knight. You can't play as Clark Kent. The main villain is Brainiac. Nerfed Superman, which means he's like the animated series. And I don't know about you, but I love the animated series. More than the movie, because this one felt more modern. You know, it was... It's more in 2000s. It was a futuristic city, you know. Uh, Semi-destructible environments. Think AK. No buildings are falling over. A uh, combat system in integrates the flying. So yeah, it's in the Arkham universe, and there's tons of Easter eggs of Superman's lore with some events that took place in Batman Arkham franchise. Now this is planned for the Justice League game down the road, and the announcement should be coming out in a couple of weeks before E3. Now, I want to talk about more about this animated series because, man, I have a passion for that show. I, I love that show. They did kind of nerf Superman in that show. And that's kind of why I like it. Because when Superman first appeared, he wasn't so overpowered. He he had only a few abilities. He could leap tall buildings in a single bound. That's where that comes from. Is because he couldn't fly and stuff. He was pretty limited in his superpowers. And there were so many things that really made him more powerful. Like the Max Fletcher cartoons are the ones that made him fly and a whole bunch of other stuff like that. So in the TV show, they kind of dimmed down his powers and I like that because in the movies he seemed super overpowered where he had so many outrageous abilities and whereas the other ones he was kind of fixed on a certain amount. Anyway, let me know what you think and I'll see you next time.